All right, so in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to source dirt and rock in bulk for like landscaping jobs, things like that. Clear river rock, seven eighths to one and one half inch for gardens, um, large scale dirt projects for leveling things such as pavers, getting paver sand for pavers, um, putting dirt around trees to fight erosion like we're gonna do today, or just building gardens themselves. You know, there's a lot of grass, you need to cover it up, you wanna dirt it, you know, you just gotta make it nice. Sometimes if you, use chemical to kill a lot of weeds you might want to put a bunch of potting soil over the top so that if you're planting flowers or something it's not growing in that chemical dirt as some time to kind of you know clear away before it's it's you know it can root its base roots in that potting soil so anyways there's a there's a bunch of applications for bulk dirt rock and paper sand but i'm going to show you today how we source it so we're going to hit minic materials it's our local supply store you've probably got one in your area um, and show you guys what it looks like the different pricing on whether you self-load or you have a loader load it um, buying it by the ton, buying it in bulk versus buying it by the shovel load. So we're gonna break all that down today. Come with us. All right, so I just walked in, we pulled up. I got one ton of rich mix. This is gonna be great for getting grass to grow and stopping erosion around a tree. Um, if that's the point of what you're doing, you're gonna wanna get rich mix. You can do topsoil if it's just dirt, but rich mix is better for getting grass seeds to prosper, especially around April whenever uh, you know, they're just starting to grow and the sun's starting to come out and starting to heat up. It's a good time to put down some rich mix and get some seed in there. So now that I've bought one ton of this, uh, the way it works is I'm going to pull back here and they're going to use a loader to dump one ton of it on my trailer. I put down uh, two tarps so we don't get any dirt like in the wood and make a mess. Um, and then we're going to hit the property, unload it by a wheelbarrow, and then whatever is left on the tarp that's too small to shovel, we can just use the tarp to dump the final bit in the wheelbarrow. Trailer's clean, everything's ready to go, dirt's installed. Um, so I'll show you guys what that looks like when we get loaded up, and then we'll get to our property. And as for cost, we're looking at about $44, $47 after tax for the total, for the ton of rich mix. Topsoil is a little cheaper, it's like $33. Um, but this is some good quality stuff, so we'll pay a bit of a premium, but so not really super expensive um, total uh, because I know this customer, um, we're gonna give them a pretty good deal and we're just gonna do the whole job for 100, including coming here, buying it, picking it up, delivering it, installing it, and making sure everything's right, and then we're also gonna clean up their property a little bit. So um, kind, of a, kind of a quick day today, but we'll get this dirt and then we'll get there. So we're here at our property laying our dirt. I'm kind of finagled in weird just to be as close as possible, um, but still not in the way in the street um, to our area here where we're applying our dirt. So we just started off with two wheel wheelbarrow loads. Uh, we've got a couple more to go. Um, we'll keep laying it out here and uh, then lay some grass seed and see if we get some grass to start growing um, in the next couple weeks. 